The devout across our area are about to mark the start of Lent, a time of reflection based on the biblical account of the death and resurrection of Christ. Local 5's Chris Schuler looks at the way Christians in Northeast Wisconsin celebrate the season. John the Baptist has been raised from the dead. For the next six weeks in Christian churches across Northeast Wisconsin. It's Congregations will gather to pause and reflect on the biblical accounts of the sacrifices Christ made wandering in the desert for 40 days and 40 nights. There is something special about that in regard to getting back in touch with their spiritual life. Leading up to his death on the cross and resurrection three days later. His suffering and death, um, we believe, covers our sins, so we focus on that. From Catholics to Lutherans, even non-denominational churches. I think the significance of Lent is about sacrifice. Believers in the Bible celebrate this church season in varying degrees. Yeah. Father Andrew Saferni says Lent for Catholics is about fasting and reflection. It's the sense of, by prayer and abstinence and almsgiving, opening ourselves to a greater communication of God. Many Catholics give up meat all the Fridays of Lent and instead hit the fish fry. Some fast, but not to the level of the early church. In our depriving ourselves, we uh, join ourselves to the suffering of Christ. On Ash Wednesday, churchgoers will walk to the altar to receive the sign of the cross on their foreheads in ash, a Lenten tradition that Pastor John Zabel of St. Paul Lutheran says he's brought to his church. Ashes remind us that without God we are dust, but we focus on what God giving us life. For Lutherans, Pastor Zabel says Lent is about preparation for Easter. No fasting required, just a focus on one's spiritual future. Time to kind of be honest and think about where we stand, um, what's missing in us and what God has done to help us. God, help me to be somebody. At non-denominational Life Church in De Pere, Pastor Sean Hennessy says the principles of Lent are practiced year-round. It's about pushing out distraction and about focusing on the one thing that really matters. Evangelical in their doctrine, there is no official Lenten season for this church. It's all about the one thing that we all have in common, and that is the love of Jesus. And in 2017, that blurring of the lines might not be considered such a bad thing. There is a connection um, between what is taught in Christian churches, and really we would say the, the big connector is that Jesus is our Savior. We have different methods, yes. but many of us have the same message. I think Lent is one of the places where there is a kind of convergence of the Christian churches. Many of which will be filled with the faithful heading into Easter Sunday. And for Christians, the season of Lent officially begins this coming Wednesday. Chris Schuler, Local 5.